Dozens of northern pike are back home in the waters of Green Bay tonight after being trapped in their spring spawning grounds. Now the fish make their way upstream to the wetlands and into the ditches, but they can't make that return trip when the water levels go down. Fox 11's Eric Peterson shows us a fish rescue from the village of Swamico. In the shallow waters beneath this Swamico wetlands, this northern pike is tired, trapped, and in trouble. Well, they can swim up the ditches when the water's high, and the wetland that we have here is prime, prime habitat for northern pike to spawn in. What we've been seeing the last few years is the water level drops in the ditch, and so the pike can't get back out to the bay when they need to. But help is on the way. Crews from the DNR, Brown County Land Conservation, and UW-Green Bay used portable shocking equipment to flush out the fish. It temporarily stuns the fish, um, doesn't hurt them, and oh, yeah. enough time to stun them for somebody to be able to net them. Scott Sonovan and his family checked out the operation Monday morning. It's pretty interesting. It's yeah. nice to see the, the northern going back to the bay. and. Uh, Exciting for the boys to see big fish up close. The fish were measured 36.8 inches. And for the first time, tagged. If we have any of those same fish with tags that we tagged this year, it will give us some information if the same fish come to the same place year after year. It's a place that may be getting smaller. A lot of these um, wetlands were lost years and years ago when all the ditching was, was done on, on the West Shore. So a lot of the wetlands that were connected to these stream networks are, are gone either either filled or, or, or fish don't have access to them. In all, 41 northern pike traveled three and a half miles to the Swamico boat landing to be released back into the bay. We know that um, naturally this happens on, in many wetlands all the way up and down the bay. Any little bit we can do helps. In Swamico, Eric Peterson, Fox 11 News. Check that out. Well, the DNR says this is the only fish rescue plan, but they say crews may be back if the warm temperatures trigger another spawning run.